everyone, I wanted to do a specific video over my Louis Vuitton um, Emily wallet. And this one, I just wanted to share with you guys what I carry in my wallet or how I pack my wallet. I know um, I've seen different videos and people um, pack it different ways. And I just want to show you how I pack my Emily wallet because I know um, people are always wondering if uh, this wallet can hold... A lot of stuff in there and for it being a smaller wallet it can hold quite a bit so like I've showed um, I've done a video on this on a review and it sh um, has four credit card slots in the front and then it has this zipper area here and then it has a slot here another one here and then one deep one in the back so so for me I'm just going to use some just random uh, cards and these are just little um, Victoria's Secret gift cards that my daughter picked up at the store so, so I can just show you as an example of how I fit stuff in here so usually in the front slots I will put um, my driver's license debit card and credit card so just putting them in to kind of give you an idea and I never uh, double up my card, so I always put one in each slot. And I know some people will put like two on each slot, and it stretches out the the slots. So if you don't want your leather to stretch out, I recommend you only putting one card per slot. And then here on the zipper zipper part, I will put um, change in there. But um, right now I don't have any change, but I try not to fill it up because I don't want to stretch out the leather. And then here on the, the slot behind the zipper area, I usually put like my extra cards that I have. So I'm just going to grab, like these will be like extra cards, uh, debit cards or credit cards or whatever. And I try to lay, so I try to even it out across here so I'll have all my cards here just out lined out like this and then on the slot behind there I don't know if you can see that this slot here I normally put like receipts and stuff so here are some receipts so I'll just Put the receipts in there and then here in the back I put my cash so I have some cash here just open it up because it fits the cash fits in there perfectly when it's laid out like this so you get that and just stick it in there and you want to slide it all the way down to the bottom where it hits and then we just close it up and like I mentioned before you have this little tab here from the zipper pull you want to leave it on the inside so when it um, if you leave it out and you put it in your bag or your purse it will um, tend to um, bend and it will stay that way and more than likely the color will start coming off so I would say put it inside the bag or inside the wallet and as you can tell there's like still a lot of space left in the wallet there's no bulk added to it or anything and here like I said you have the four slots I mean the four cards and you have let me see how many cards I extra I have in here so there's two three four five six there's eight other cards here and these are like gift card and I, um, these are like gift card like regular credit cards here and then I have like little reward points business cards or whatever and these fit perfectly in there and you can even put more cards in there and you can add more receipts more cash and then you know change in here and this is even without change so the change will add a little bulk to it but like I said I try not to put a whole bunch of change in my bag but you know what 
I think I have some change in my pocket, so let's put some change in there. So I have some change here. Put it in there. And there's still no bolt to it. So yeah, this is how I pack my Louis Vuitton uh, Emily wallet. And it can fit a lot. You know, this is not even near the amount that you can put inside of here and carry in it. So this is a wallet that I would recommend to anybody to um, purchase. And I know that this is in the lower end of the price for a Louis Vuitton wallet. I know you can get like the Empreinte leather wallet and that one can cost you about eight, nine hundred dollars along with like the Insulate wallet. And this one it only costs like 480 I believe. So this is on the lower end to um, purchase a good wallet. And I know um, I've heard in videos that people go and purchase wallets like $20 $20 or $30 wallets and those tend to break on them or tear or ruin and they have to go back out and buy another wallet and they'll go buy another $20, $30 wallet and then they have to and they have to repeatedly do that every you know so often because you know you use your wallet a lot when you don't even realize how much you use your wallets so this one I've had this for almost a year I believe yeah next month will be a year and I've used it about five times or so and each time I used it I used it about a week to two weeks and you know you constantly going in and out of your purse opening it closing it you know pulling out money and stuff so you're you know putting a lot of wear on your wallet and for it this one for it um, taking a lot of beating on it it's it's held up really well you know there's no the glazing isn't peeling there's no scratches the only thing I think I mentioned before is this coloring here on the bag but that's from it going in and out of my my bags and stuff and rubbing on stuff but the actual red has not peeled off so like I said I would recommend this as a first time Louis Vuitton wallet if you're going to purchase a Louis Vuitton wallet so yeah, so if you have any questions or comments, please leave the comment down below and please like and subscribe to my channel and I will be seeing you guys later.